Wow, was that song cool. I don't know how they did it. I already love Rock Solid. Everybody loved Rock Solid. And then they made... Perfection. Wow. That is such a cool song. That is so going on my iPod. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed the entire tune. I did, I did play the entire tune for you. So be sure to look it up in case you missed it or you just didn't decide to watch the screen, which I understand. It's only audio. Uh, go ahead and look up this song. Definitely worth your while. And can I make it? Yes. Come here. So really, not much has changed. Well, the club has had a complete overhaul, but I mean, as far as the rest of this chapter goes, not much has changed. And I should have apologized in Bad Fur Day about how much cutscene is in this part of the Let's Play. I never noticed it while in editing or while I was recording it, but damn, there's a lot of me no talking. Ah, back to Rock Solid. Good old Rock Solid. And I never did mention that bouncer looks awesome. It actually looks like he could fuck you up instead of just being a reskin of a rock monster. It's even got a little Bluetooth walkie talkie. Amazing. The boss. I've actually never seen the Untouchables. If it's a regular. Oh, loading screen. Imagine that. If it's another gangster film, I'd gladly watch that. I need to watch more films. Missed out on The Godfather. The Untouchables looks okay if it's. If this is the reference you get from it. I just miss out on movies too focused on all the games. Try to steal my dough. I really like Don Weezo. He's he's the Don, man. You don't you don't mess with the Don. You don't take the Don's money. You don't do that. Like yeah. I think I already made that joke. And the reason she doesn't recognize me, could it be because she's blonde? No offense to all the blondes out there. I'm just fooling. Get out of here, bitch. Got one more thing to do, alright? I'll be with you in a minute. Just love how this guy talks. I want to be a Don. I want to be able to order people around and kill them when they double cross me. Nah, I'm not that violent. Um, here's a little change. Not only does the Don look good and his little weasel buddies look good, but they're no longer color coded. Frankie's red. Chicho's red. I guess he's got the zigzag pattern there. Polly's red. So how are you supposed to know the difference between these guys? I mean, I know the multiplayer completely got rid of all the, you know, characters that made it fun and just made it another war multiplayer kind of thing. But, you know, you could play as the, as the weasels here. And now they're completely gone. Which is probably why the color had to be changed. But uh, you could have kept it in and nobody would have noticed. I mean, it's their first time picking up Bad Fur Day or Live and Reloaded. They won't know the difference. Unless you're a stickler like me and is looking for every minute detail that has been changed. <laughs> oh, here's another good one. I'm, I'm giving Rare a lot of props for the changes they made. For better or for worse. Like when Conker censored himself from saying fellatio and he felt bad for it. Here's another one that I thought was really funny. Uh, when watching Bad Fur Day, he goes through the slideshow. And yes, thank you, Don. I think I know what a bomb is. When he's going through the slideshow here. The second slide is from, you know, his rock lady friend named Roxy. Yeah, here's something I don't get. You want to get rid of the cavemen, but they are your main source of income. And if you blow up the cavemen, you blow up the rock monster, so rock solid's gone. So, um, getting rid of my profits. So I'm going to murder everyone. Oh, there we go. Furries, eat your heart out. Tetherballs! I actually know what they are now. Drop it right here, causing the entire volcano to rise... Up to one point. Yeah, that still seemed kind of weird. Volcano doesn't erupt, it just goes... And it just stops. So convenient. 
Context sensitive. All right, loading screen, and how did I know it was going to be a minute 30? Well, this is how. Instead of having you judge the wick, which never goes down, by the way, and in Bad Fur Day it did, they just give you a timer. So just like the Tickle Bees counter before it, the new bomb timer has now been installed so that Conker doesn't need to know anything about this game being hard. We wouldn't want to hurt his feelings. I mean, he was in a hard game before, and now he has to be in an easy one, kind of even it out. He's special like that. Actually, maybe that wick is going... Oh, I see. The, uh... The, the wick. The fuse there. Yeah, the, the fire, the lighting is going down. But that's it. Loading screen. There are so many of those, and you're about to see another one when we go through. And that's not coming back. It goes so slow. I think it gets stuck to the ceiling, which would be kind of weird. Wait patiently, because I have plenty of time. Ah, uh, da-dum, da-dum, da-dum. Run past you, and... Mr. Loading Screen, how are you? Oh, I'm doing fine. Get past that guy, and there's a lot more space to roam around here. And 15 seconds to spare. Take a look at that background. That looks pretty nice. So, an explosion in the middle, which wouldn't have hit the lava. And it just comes up, and... We're going to die! Nope! Oh, hi, loading screen. There for no reason. We didn't do anything. We didn't go into another room. You really needed that? And we've got some skeletons at the top. We've got some cavemen drawings. I'm not sure what they mean. If you know, if these have any meaning at all, please let me know. I would love to know. And don't be an idiot. Don't stand on these. Uh, I am so dead. Unless I can salvage it here. Nope. They go by Mario 64 logic. You know, you burn your butt in lava, you don't stop moving even when you land. And now I'm dead. Whoa, loading screen. You didn't see that. Because I cut it out. Oh no, one squirrel tail. You know how many I have. I have such bad luck coming up here. And, oh look, clan goblins, where they don't need to be here. All right, well, we went through rock solid. We did Don Weezo's bidding again. So uh, I, th I think we're going to end it off here. So next time on Conker's Bad Fur Day, we are going to explore the rest of Caveman Land. Sounds like something out of the Super Mario Brothers Super Show. See you later.